Hello out there. Time for a five minute video and how to complete math book or math composition book pages M4. Uh, M, we call this M3 and a half and M3. So M4 is what we did first. I'm going to recreate that here. The first thing we did was we took the numbers of our students in our class, one, we went all the way to 28, even though we only have 24 students, just because. So we did this first. We did next to the red line, one, two, and then we started skipping lines, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and so on. 14, okay? So one to 14 on this side, and then I'll double it over there. I'm gonna fold this in half so I have a proper, proper spacing. And then once we went through and wrote those numbers, the second thing we did was we doubled them, right? And I started with, I started it out of order on purpose so that the students, so that the students would uh, write these down and start to notice patterns of their own. So for example, this is what we did. We did eight, and then we doubled eight. So eight, 16, and then we went back to eight and we tripled it. So eight tripled is 24. And then we went back to eight again and we cut eight in half. So it's the first number, it, we double it. So we have the number, we double it, triple it, cut it in half. And then lastly, we find out how far away from 100 is that number. So eight is 92 away from 100. And then lastly, what we did was we assigned color codes and I forgot my colors. So I'll just, is this sound? Yeah, I'll just keep talking. <laughs> Sorry, I'll go get my colors. But what you need to do is you need to have blue, brown, purple, and green. I'll get those right now. Blue, brown, purple, green. Blue, brown, purple, green. Brown, blue, purple, that's blue, purple, Green. Yay. Yeah, it didn't take too long. So now that I have those colors, I'm going to, and again, I, I always recommend students do this in pencil, but since I, you know, I want the video, the camera here to be able to view it, so I'm going to use marker here. So 16, brown is tripled. Oh, and it was fun to have the students. We, we drew sticks and the students all chose the colors for these. Um, purple. Half is purple. And then how far away from 100 is green. Okay. So the step one, if you want, it depends on the, on the mathematician here. Some people like to do it this way. Other people prefer to go all the way through and do all the numbers at once. For example, since the first or the blue row is all doubled, I'll do double one is two, double two is four, double three is six. Notice the pattern, two, four, six. Double four is eight, double five, double six, and so on. So maybe that's more, that makes more sense to you is to go down this way and then triple it. So uh, one times three is three, Two times three is six. Three times three is nine. And again, some people prefer to do this because they can see the pattern emerge because they might not have their times tables committed to memory just yet. Four times three is 12. Five times three is 15. Six times three is 18. And then you can also, students, if you don't have these memorized yet, just add three every time. 18 plus three is 21 because seven times three is 21 and so on. And then the next step was to do these these numbers that are half of numbers. Now, for most of us, the half of the number is easier if the number's even. Half of eight is four. Half of six is that. Half of four is that. And half of two is that. And now in between, just like we number our pages in half numbers, we also number these uh, half digits in half numbers. For example, two, half of two is one, and half of four is two. Midway between one and two is 1.5, also known as one and a half. 
halfway through five, sorry, four and halfway between two and three is two and a half, which just so happens to be half of five. Half of five, two and a half. So what I'll do, half of seven is three and a half, three and a half, or 3.5. So what I'm gonna do is I'll go ahead and continue this. Half of one is <laughs> 0 0.5. And then, so all you do is fill out M4. That's the first thing you need to do. Oh, and we're at five minutes. So M4, that's how you do it. Uh, I'm gonna record a second video to explain what to do with M3.5, okay? Aloha, au revoir.